In this world of content, well, everybody wants to create some videos, right? But the main thing nowadays, well, we gotta be fast. And of course, we gotta use AI tools for that. The tool that we're gonna use today is called Pictory.ai. Don't worry, it's nothing complicated. I'll show you the steps. And this one is really cool. It even adds the captions to your videos. Because as you know, you just scroll the Instagram, YouTube, sometimes you just don't have the sound on. And this results in 12% longer view time. And these people have partnered up with Storyblocks. They've got a lot of stock footage and you can use it if you are partnered up with Pictory.ai. I'm also gonna show you how you can just use ChatGPT to get your own scripts. And no, we're not gonna use it the way all these people are doing it. We're gonna go step by step. So let's just go with the step number one. Head over to Pictory.ai and just get started for free. When you make yourself an account, they're gonna ask you, what do you wanna do? In today's video, I'm just gonna use this to monetize on YouTube. Just click on start using Pictory and then this is the dashboard that you are gonna land on. I know it's hard to get monetized on YouTube, but trust me, it's all about the hard work. It's not like some kind of a mystical figure that it has like some secret recipe for success. Trust me, it's not. All you have to do is to be consistent and work hard on it. If you want some more help, I'm gonna leave a link down there in the description. So let's just now talk about Picturey. First of all, you've got four options you can make the videos from scripts by using this one. Simple script, you can make it with ChatGPT, stay tuned for that, and they will make the video for you. The second option is article to video. So you can just find the blog out there and you can just copy the link and they will make the video for you. Or if you have the blog of your own, you can just take that blog and make your whole blog in two videos. The last two options is like edit video using text and visuals to video. This is a bit more complicated and it doesn't give like so, so great results. This is just something that if you wanted to make a video for a certain company or something like that. So if you are a freelancer, you can use this. So in order to get monetized on YouTube, you know what needs to be done. But as I've told you, consistency and dedication will get you there. So the first step is just going to script to video. We're gonna focus on this today. Click on the proceed button. And all you gotta do now is to start typing the script or just paste the script. I'm gonna use a little part of my script that I made beforehand and later I'm gonna show you how you can make the same script with the help of ChatGPT. So this is the little script that we're gonna work with today. Now the first thing that you gotta know is that you don't want to just like put the whole script like this. This is way too long. In order for Pictory to give you the subtitles, the captions, the way they need to be, you have to space these out. Otherwise, they're just gonna be too long. So this is what you need to do. For example, you can just go and just hit the enter key on these parts of sentences where you think the video would be nice to change. So in each one of these, as you can see, that's gonna be a different video. And of course, you know, nowadays you have to make a well fast paced video because the attention span and all of that. You have to be, especially in the hook, you have to be fast. So by doing all of this, you will do that. All right, so this is what I wanna do like this. Just space all these like accordingly and then Pictory will know what to do, all right? I'm just gonna leave like this last one like it is to show you how this is not good to leave like a little long sentence like this one. And all I have to do now is to click on the proceed. You can enter the video name as well here. I'm just gonna put real estate. I'm gonna click on the proceed button and the next step that you gotta do is you have to choose the templates. To be honest, there's no like great templates here. They really lack like serious templates. They really lack like modern templates. But there are a few, and I'm gonna show you which, that you can use right away to have a good feeling. So, as you can see, this is not good. Like this is not looking so professional and you can just ignore all of these, but the one that you wanna take care for is the subtitle yellow. So this one is caption yellow, and this one is good as well, 
this one caption thin but for the sake of this video i'm just going to use this one so caption yellow if you want to make a youtube short you're going to choose this aspect ratio and if you want to make a long form content which we want to do today we're going to choose 16 by 9 and now they will prepare the storyboard what they're doing now well they're just reading the script and they will find the relevant content for you so if it says like i don't know bread they will show you the picture of bread so basically they're just doing what every video editor would do and they would use story blocks and they would just go and download the content manually so this really saves up the time and you don't have to hire the video editor they use content from story blocks and if you know story blocks is really really expensive as you can see this is like 30 dollars for unlimited all access per month and that is just way too much so here it is this is our intro scene as you can see the real estate industry is in a state of a constant flux and you can just play this video for example later of course you can just add the background music which is going to now delete the background music I don't need it for this video to show you but in all honesty this first video is not so good it doesn't look so professional and it doesn't draw my attention that much so what can you do well all you have to do is head over here to visuals click on the visuals and have a look at this they're also partnering up with Getty images so you've got two of those Getty images and story blocks now what do you want to do well you just want to type in real estate if that's what your video is about click on real estate and you will get all these videos which you can use with just like this so just click on it and that video will come in there so this is your like first video and all you have to do now is to go back to the story and now just play the video once more I'm just gonna go and delete this background music once more I don't need this and then you just go and check the scene number two as you can see this is good for me until it goes to the scene number three and you can add even like these transitions as you can see you've got many of these transitions so for example if I just click on smooth left it'll go from this scene to this scene really smoothly now look what happens with this one this is a longer one as you can see it's not looking too beautiful right it's big text the video is going to be too long and the watch time is not going to be so good because of this and you know that we need watch time apart from views on YouTube right to succeed so what can you do you can just click here and you can see here split scene you can split the scene or you can just click like mouse is here and you can just hit the enter key one more time now when you're done with this one you can add the voiceover you can record your own you can apply AI voiceover and you can upload your own if you just record it somewhere else now in order to get monetized on YouTube please do not please AI voiceovers because there's a lot of people out there that are using it and they can't get monetized